that will hit the door, uh, the quarter panel, then do the trunk, the bumper, uh, the right side quarter panel, then work around to the door, the fender, the hood, and just catch up to the other side. So, you know, make sure you follow a pattern when you go around your car. This way, when you're done, you, you want to make sure you get inside of that fender well, too. A lot of people miss that, and after the paint job's done, they see dry spots around the, the, the wheel well. All right, so make sure you get in there with the gun and, and just wet that whole area. So here's the finished product in the booth. Uh, the paint flowed out really nice. This is the next morning, uh, probably about 15 hours later. I came back to the booth and we're going to take the tape off and uh, bring it home. So in the ne next little clip here, you're going to see it at my house um, just like that done. And uh, the next steps will be buffing. So I'll see you in the buffing videos. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks. Okay, so here's the overall paint job. Uh, we're all done. It uh, came out fabulous. Looks really good. Hardly any dust on it. Um, but we are going to still color sand and buff uh, probably the doors, the hood, uh, the trunk area, maybe the tops of the fenders and quarter panel. Uh, just the highlighted areas we will gloss. Came out pretty good. You can see me right there. But if we color sand and buff it, it's going to look a lot more shinier than that. You can see. Do better like that. See.